So in this project, the design is the OFTM implementation system using multi-user or MISO. Okay, so in this implementation, the important thing is the channel estimation. Channel estimation means uh, we are uh, forming on transmission packets, that is signals. After that, we are uh, transmitting our packet, that is OFDM signals, into the channel. After that, propagation signal will be received in the receiver path. Okay, so when we implementing this path, that is transmitter and propagation into channel and receiving from the receiver. The channel implementations having some noises or some other propagation fading effects. Likewise, some additional effects are added into the signal, original signal. So we need to recover the original signals from the channel part. Okay, that is called as the channel estimation. So in this paper, uh, methodology is that sparse based channel estimation. So sparse means uh, we are uh, going to verify some reference contents from the transmitter part and uh, comparing it into the channel signals okay so here we are uh, choosing a methodology of pilot design pilot design means we are going to include the pilot data to identify where the original signals are placed so without uh, the identified signal we simply skip the remaining uh, signals from the receiver path okay it is termed as a sparse channel estimation so in this implementation we are having uh, the three part one is the transmitter section and the receiver section and the channel estimation part okay so first thing we are uh, encoding we are having some parameter initializations like this recovery algorithm is least square estimation as well as our uh, two methodologies one is the paper algorithm sparse estimation and another one is the compressive sensing methodology so all these three algorithms will be performed in this same code okay so first thing is that uh, sparse estimation the channel estimation iterations how many iterations has to be performed for the channel estimation then OFTM parameters okay after this process we are uh, assigning the pilot designs so how many pilots we are choosing and the pilot will be assigned in which po diagonal uh, which positions okay diagonal based uh, pilot assignment or else orthogonal based pilot assignment both the things you can uh, choose as per your wish so for channel ls channel estimations uh, it has to be uh, only the pilot based okay so for ls estimation uh, that's why we are choosing a diagonal it is compatible for all the channel estimation methodologies uh, here the pilot designing okay so uh, how many pilots we are choosing here depends upon the pilot designs the random permutations will be performed and depends upon this permutation position the pilot bits are allocated so these are the pilot positions generated in here after that help pilots is nothing but our secure pilots okay to easy identify our original signals here we are make it as a sparse for sparse channel estimation okay after this, these are the initial parameters to getting uh, MSC means square error value of uh, three algorithms LS, sparse, and compressive sensing. Mm, so, first process is that uh, channel creation of channel signals. So, channel signals having some uh, number of parameters. So, how many iterations and how many length that transmit signals, how many transmit signals, what is the parameter of bandwidth we are using. And transmission vector delay vector something these are the parameters for uh, channel creations okay channel creations will be generated by the channels impulse response that is H matrix okay H matrix will be generated in here after that the channel calculation we are performing the transmission part so this is the channel coefficients calculation uh, which means channel matrix the default channel matrix in this channel matrix only we are going to add our original signals which means con convolution process okay after this the transmission started here signal generations after that the qpsk signal converting into the qpsk signals pilot signals will be placed in here after that the modulations now uh, mc modulation is nothing but the OFD modulation okay so OFD modulation will be performed after that the signals generated signals will be passed into the channel content okay so channel signal will be received into the receiver path the receiver path we are having the 
pilot removing demodulations after that the pilot based channel estimation so channel estimations are started here so first part uh, channel estimation so roughly where are the pilot bits are positioned uh, we are extracting the original signals after that we are having three different process one is the least square based analysis and uh, our sparse based analysis this is the least least square based analysis and the MSE estimation after that the DFT um, means uh, in that Fourier transform is performed inverse Fourier here the Fourier transform another thing is that the sparse estimation our paper algorithm okay after this compressive sensing based analysis after completing this one we are estimating the bit error of uh, the complete three algorithms and the MSC all these things will be stored in one uh, structure that is number of parameters are there so we are stored in into the SP1 structured variable and we are storing it as the values out that will be after you running that you are getting the values out dot mat file so from this this thing I just given as a separate file here now I just added into the final main itself so after we loading the values out we are having MSC values after that the BER value bit error value so all these things will be generated so when you run this code you will be get the figure results the one most important thing is that you have to install CVX CVX toolbox from the open source Google itself you can simply search CVX you can get the CVX file for 64 bit and simply just placed in this folder download that CVX uh, rare file placed in here extract one within that CVX you are having one setup file simply run that setup file after that you have to run this file because here we are having the convex optimization that's why we are using a CVX CVX is the nothing but convex optimization toolbox So in this code executions you, you may get errors depends upon two parameters one is a so after the execution of this results we, we can get the performance of MSC ok MSC for LS sparse and compressive sensing we are getting a minimum MSC value in compressive sensing and sparse compared with the LS ok and this uh, MSC is for a different algorithm uh, not for different algorithm different uh, group size here we have just shown only the compressive uh, sensing output this curve only displayed separately in figure 2 after that figure 3 is a bit error ratio bit error ratio is compared with uh, sparse and LS compressive sensing getting very low BER ok with the minimum SNR and these are the intermediate results that is signal transmitted signal with the pilot addition 
and the modulator signals or transmitter side with the receiver signal and this is the signal demodulated output okay um, two things you have to install mex compiler and cvx toolbox after that only this code will completely run perfectly okay thank you